I'm broken. It's boring. I'm clean. That's you, Mommy. Hello, everyone. Welcome to today. It is, what it, day is it? It's the 22nd? 23rd? 22nd? I think it's Friday. 22nd. Whatever, who cares? Christmas is in a couple of days. I'm so excited. I am taking the weekend off from posting and editing. I'm with the twins and we're just playing in the ball pit right now. There's a lot of fun things to do today. I'm going to start the process of planning all the treats I'm going to bake for the Christmas cookie party that I do every year. It's a tradition I've been doing since I was 16. I'm going to go get started on doing all the things I need to do. All right, we were about to do advent calendar and then there was a change of plans. So it's been pouring rain where we live and we don't get much rain but there's a creek that we like to go to sometimes and in the summer we spend a lot of time in the creek catching pollywogs or tadpoles whatever you call them and catching frogs and just enjoying the creekness of life anyway it's been a little bit dry because we haven't had rain in a long time but we just had a lot of rain so we're hoping there's a bunch of water in it now and i've always heard that if you're a rock hunter and oh sorry i got your walkie talkie check check is this flynn over um that's interesting i'm in the car so eric and flynn walked a very long walk to the creek and i did some stuff at home and then i was like i'm gonna meet up with them so i drove here and flynn got a walkie talkie today from the elf the elf on the shelf so i'm talking about <gasps> there's flynn flynn i think i see you outside the car <laughs> Anyway, I'm gonna go check out the creek. I've heard that rock hunters go to creeks right after rains to find rocks. And I'm like, I've never done that. I've only ever rock hunted at a beach. So I'm very excited to see if there's any rocks. I'm not a good creek rock hunter, I guess, because I don't know how to find a good creek rock. But I collected some, and I think it might be fun to try to tumble a whole like batch of just creek rocks and see how that goes. But I didn't get very many. And they're all honestly kind of ugly. Like I didn't do it. I just didn't know what I was looking for. I didn't know how to do it. Someone who knows how to creek rock hunt in California, tell me what I'm looking for. Hunting for rocks at the beach is so easy. They're all like beautiful, glowing, tumbled rocks. Like so, I don't know. Anyway, I'm gonna go. Do you wanna do Advent? You wanna do the rocks? Yeah. Flynn wants to do his advent first. Okay, over. Are you excited? Oh, I said it. You are. Mama, I said to do rocks. I'm excited to do rocks, yeah. Um, I'm excited to do Taylor Swift too. Okay. Here, you're number 22. Let's do it. I don't much get to rock. What'd you get? Maisie got a little blue doll today. A monster truck. You got a monster truck? Oh, Flynn got M&Ms. And a guy. And a guy. He got a little yeah, man I'm and M&Ms. So the babies have officially taken all the stickers off of all of my bags for my advent of rocks and taken all the rocks. Yeah, I, so I don't know which Mom, ones we were Mom, on. Which ones we have. What? I even took a sticker off. Oh geez, even fun took a sticker off of them. So let's see if I can find the number 22 that we're on. Yes. So that's an arrowhead, it's for protection. A little bag, an arrows tour bag. Cute. Oh my gosh, chaos in this house. Flynn and I are doing Legos. What, let me see. It's supposed to go like this, and mm -hmm. I need two of them. Let me see. We have to keep going and then we'll find it. Okay. Someone was singing Jingle Bell Rock earlier, like Miranda. Like Miranda? Miranda, Miranda, Told you this takes teamwork. You were right. Okay, this side has a lot of pieces. Mm -hmm. So you have to build this thing. Do you like my laugh? What kind of laugh? Let me hear it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a great laugh. You didn't. Oh, it's the wheels! It's the wheels! We got to do the wheels! We're Best gonna part, do man. the wheels! It's the wheel time, wheel time! Oh, 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 doing it right! Oh, you're doing it right! You're doing it right! What? You're doing it right! Yes! We love so many fixes and finishes the, <laughs> the song! The resolve! Yeah. You are my son! <laughs> That's not the page we were on. I'm sorry about that. <laughs> Here's the moment, the final we go. piece. Yeah, yeah, baby! Whoa, does it steer? Holy smoly magoly. Love it. 
so cool, dude. This is the activity of the evening. And she has been completed. Someday we're gonna take it all apart and, well, maybe not or something. Maybe not or something. Okay, so I have got, oh, there's something in my sock. What the heck? Hello, you're not welcome in here. Anyway, I saw this lip oil on TikTok. It popped on my free page. So it's, I think it's a woman owned business, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, cruelty free, vegan, handmade with love, black and Latina owned, women owned. That's so freaking cool. So it's um, by Boss Up Cosmetics. And it's a lip oil that changes color once it hits your lips. So I was like, I wanna try this. So I bought it and it's here. Look how freaking pretty the packaging is. I obviously am not a makeup person. I'm not a makeup guru. I'm like, I don't know anything and I'm an idiot, but that's pretty girl. Why is that packaging so cute? I love her. Okay, anyway. And it's also a lip stain. So if you let it sit on your lips for a couple minutes, then it will stain your lips. And y'all know I've been looking for a lip stain for like literally two years. So a good one that I like. So let's try it. It's gonna be hard because I'm like looking in my viewfinder instead of a mirror, which I probably should use a mirror, but whatever. And I also just put a makeup wipe on my lips, wiped off anything that could have possibly been on it. Is it changing color yet? No, I think it is. Oh my God, it is turning pink. Wait, hold on, this is cool. Wait, it's turning pink. <gasps> Ew, I love it. Okay, hold on. Wait, I love this. It was literally like $10 or $11. Like it was like super cheap, but it's totally working. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna let it sit on my lips for a couple minutes and then I'm going to see how dark pink it gets. And then I'm gonna rub it off and see if it stained my lips at all. So I'll see you in two minutes. Obviously this is not sponsored. I think we all know by now that like anything I talk about is not sponsored, <laughs> but I just saw it on TikTok and I wanted to try it. So far I'm living for it. Okay, let me just let this sit on my lips for two minutes and I'll see you guys in a second. Okay, it's been a couple minutes and it's kind of like a hot like Barbie pink, which I love. I think, I guess she said it's different on everyone, but I'm gonna wipe it off and see if it stained my lips at all. No, I think it did, I think it did. I definitely want like a gloss to put on top. I don't like like super dry lips, but it looks like it stained my lips. I mean, it totally stained my lips. That's so cool, I love this. Hey, TikTok shop getting me again. TikTok shop literally is so annoying, but like sometimes there's some really good finds. Okay, bye. Okay, I'm trying to find lighting that works, but it feels like it's not great every which location. But hello, it's Christmas Eve and it's been hectic. I feel like as years go by, it gets more and more hectic, the more children that I have. So I am tired. I spent all day yesterday kind of wrapping presents and prepping and last minute things. And then today uh, we're getting gas right now and we're gonna go to my brother's house and spend Christmas Eve with him and his kids. And we're very excited. There's gonna be a white elephant. So I have a couple of gifts I'm very excited about for the white elephant party. And Rachel's coming over tonight to help set up for Christmas. I'm just excited. I love Christmas time. It's all wonderful and exciting and fun. Oh my goodness, it's time to go to Cousins. The babies are awake from nap. It's time to go. Yay! One hour later. It's time. You ready? You see the Cousins? Okay. Guy. We're hanging out in the backyard. <laughs> Maisie's watching her dog run around. <laughs> Is that funny, Wizzy? The kids are all playing, and I'm just so excited for Jessica's pavlova. It's like my favorite <laughs> Christmas Eve treat. Is this on a bad setting again? Oh, yeah, Chi Chi. I can't tell if this is like on a lame setting or not. Maisie and Wesley are into the song Jingle Bells right now. Oh, what fun it is to run when we're soaping snacks. <laughs> Good job, I see. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle all the way. Oh, the day it's true, I love it. Yay! Jingle all the way. Oh, what fun it is to ride a one horse soap and sleigh. We're about to do Christmas crackers, which aren't very popular in America. I never had heard of them until people in London had told me about them. But they're like these little cute thingy mabobbers that you pull and they pop and there's little prizes inside okay, of it. I'll we tried you guys it. A story. We, we learned about these. these crackers, the okay. tradition of crackers. There we go. Oh, we're hearing about it now. In 1840, a sweet shop owner started selling sugared almonds with sentimental messages and love tokens. Watching his wood fire one Christmas, he saw a log burst into the flame with a loud crack. This inspired him to make a log shaped package for his sugared almonds that produced a surprise bang. By the end of the 19th century, it was an established Christmas tradition, and now virtually every household in the United Kingdom has at least one box during the holiday season. Did you catch that? Oh, 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 it's a mechanical 
penguin. That's the number one thing you wanted wow. this year. Wow. Whoa. Oh. Christopher won. A noisemaker? I think so. Maybe working? Here we go. It's one of those wow. things, but it's not, it does not function. You wouldn't hear it in this house anyway. But I got a blue crown. Ooh. Oh. I won. What'd you get? A penguin. And a yellow crown. No way. Wes, you won. I like it. I love your, I love your crown. So beautiful. You won! Okay, the kids are eating pavlova, and look. Is it yummy? Is it yummy? Can you eat it? Yummy. Are you riding a horse? You got traps? Hi everyone, I did not really vlog at all. It was just too exciting. We were having too much fun and there's just chaos. So sorry, I don't really have much footage from that. But now it's Christmas. I think it's 1, 1 20 a.m. And I am baking. I do a cookie holiday party every year for Christmas. I know tomorrow's gonna be really hectic and I'm probably not really gonna have a big opportunity to bake as many things as I want because I never do. So I'm not really that tired yet. I would just be sitting in my bed looking at TikTok. So why not like start baking now? You know what I mean? I'm making Hello Dollies right now. I'm just taking a couple cups of graham crackers that I've squished up to melted butter. And I'm mixing that all together to make it nice and goopy with my Merry Christmas spatula. I've shown you guys how to make Hello Dollies many a time. This is ugh, something I had never had before um, I met my mother-in-law and she made them for me once when I went to visit in Connecticut. And I think they're so delicious. So I kind of make them randomly throughout the year, but this year I was like, I need to add these to my list of things that I make for Christmas because they're delicious. So I'm just spreading out the graham cracker buttery goodness. And now we just sprinkle stuff on top that sounds delicious. For example, chocolate chips. You're supposed to do two cups of chocolate chips, but I definitely just put over. In my house, you can never have too many chocolate chips. This is a lot of chocolate. I think mean, this is too much. I have white chocolate chips, which I don't really like white chocolate very much, but I just feel like it's cute, so. Sometimes I add like butterscotch chips or you can add peanut butter chunks. Coconut. I'm supposed to measure all of these things, but it's literally 1.30 in the morning and I don't have time to measure. That looks like enough. I don't know. And now some sweetened condensed milk on top of all of it. Okay, it looks really different than it usually does, so I probably did something wrong, but who cares? Put it in the oven for like 30 minutes or something like that. I don't remember, but I gotta hurry up. I got a lot to do, and I also need to sleep at some point, so let's go in the oven. I guess while I was cooking or baking, Santa came because the presents are all out. This is crazy. The stockings are all full. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is crazy. Santa left me this glue gun and a box of like fancy little like sticks and things and a note that said that he had a lot more houses to get to tonight. He asked, he, kn he knows I love a craft. So one of his gifts to me this year was to finish up just making the room sparkle before the kids come down in a few hours. So I'm gonna take that glue gun he left for me, which is very similar to the one that Eric gave me. And I'm gonna take this box of pretty sparkly things and I'm gonna hot glue them to the fronts of presents to make everything look fancy. It might not seem like a big deal, but I feel like adding just these little bits of sparkle, just little like wiggly flopplies. I feel like it makes all the difference. And yes, I put them on my own presents. When Santa asks me to do something, I do it, okay? Even if it's on my own gift. Who doesn't love a little doodly top? It really just makes the whole place shimmer. You know what I'm saying? Anyway, that's so cool that I got to see like the beginnings of Santa's hard work tonight. It is 2.30 in the morning. The kids are gonna be up very soon, so I need to go. The Hello Dollies just came out of the oven. They're looking good. Merry Christmas Eve. Well, it's gonna be pa way past Christmas Eve when you guys see this. Merry whatever day it is for you. Tomorrow's Christmas. Stay tuned and watch the next vlog to see our Christmas morning. I'm so excited. A lot of baking to do tomorrow, but we also got the kids so many fun presents and it's just gonna be a really fun day. So I will see you guys tomorrow or whenever I get the Christmas vlog up. It just depends on how fast I can edit. But I love you guys. I missed you while I took a little break for the holiday weekend, and I will see you very soon. Merry Christmas Eve. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas.
Mama. Oh, thank you, my crazy boy. Wow! Red digger! Red digger! Wow! <laughs>